why don't we have a cafeteria or a student lounge or something where we can go get candy at four o'clock in the morning. People work such long hours in the film school. I think, yeah, you should be, have the ability to get a snack or a pick-me-up or just something. We got this cart, which was cool, but the cart closes at three o'clock and it's not open on weekends. Well, most of the people are here after 5 p.m., most of the students. And there's nowhere within walking distance here that's open at any reasonable time. I do like the idea of a vending machine, though, because most people, you know, would be editing at like midnight or something, you know, two in the morning, stuff like that. And it's like there's, that lady's not there at that time. So if I bring food in, I'm pretty, you know, secretive about it. Sometimes I'll walk in with a coffee, I'll time it out so that there's no teacher anywhere near there, and then sprint. That's the Chapman tradition, finding people for ridiculous things. They just tell me, you know, we could find you right now, but we're really not going to. And um, for me, that's just ridiculous because it's like threatening me with a fine that you're really not going to even give. I saw the student eating a burrito in the lab over a keyboard like this. And the stuff was like dripping everywhere. And those computers cost a lot of money. And no other school has the system that we have here or the equipment that we have here. And I feel very fortunate to have the computer systems that we do and the amount that we have. And it makes me angry to see somebody else abusing that. So I'm okay with them finding people. However, I also think they need to provide a place for us to go then if they're gonna find people like that. I was in the computer lab and I had a coffee because I was running late. And so I brought my coffee in there and then I went away. And somebody noticed that the coffee was there. Well, the coffee's from Starbucks, so it says my name on it, clearly. <laughs> and, um, you know, I tried to get away with it, so when the, uh, the lab assistant asked whose coffee it was, I just kind of started laughing and went about my business. And then eventually I had to go back to the coffee, and he obviously knew my name was Alex, so he came up to me and he was like, you know, Alex, you're not allowed to bring coffee in here, and I could find you. And I was like, I'm really sorry it won't happen again. And he was like, yeah, you know, I know this uh, rule is kind of ridiculous. I, I understand that it's stupid, but, you know, it's just a rule. <laughs> and I think it's funny because nobody takes it seriously, not even the people that are trying to enforce it. And I have to eat down by the gold room now. It's not friendly. Nobody wants you down here. There's equipment down here. You can't leave your stuff down here. It makes me angry. They should make a little eating room.